but I think right now just um, uh, the thing I like about her is she's gotten stronger so she's throwing a little more velocity um, her her down pitch is hard and heavy um, you know I think um, we don't really need to retool her right now um, but I think right now she's just a little more mature and has a little better understanding of what she's trying to do with hitters and so um, you know I expect that to be a strength for us this year with Mariah being up in the zone and her being down in the zone, I think it's a really good combination. And then, um, you know, you bring in Bowen or bring in Marissa. Marissa's, um, both of them can throw in all different planes. And um, I think the key is going to be for all of them to develop a good off-speed pitch. And that's one of the things I think we've been working on more than anything. How's first base looking right now? Uh, first base, we have some options, you know, and, and I, I can't really say right now exactly what it's going to look like. I think one thing about this team, there's a lot of flexibility and a lot of depth, and so you can see a lot of different lineups, um, but um, the kids we're working there right now is um, Ivy Davis, um, very athletic, and, and I think um, right now she's swinging the bat well, and I think that's going to be the key, is who's going to be swinging the bat. And, um, and uh, you know, Bowen, I think, is another option there, and I think Palomino's an option there. So we've got three. Um, and. Uh, you know, I think time will tell which way we'll go at that point. And what have you thought of uh, Charlize and how she's adjusted? So I think far? Charlize's done a good job. You know, other than the, the little incident with her finger right now, you know, she's she's down for a little bit. But um, um, she, I was impressed with her this fall. I thought she swung the bat well, um, has some maturity, um, and so she's a good leader behind the plate. Um, but again, it's just um, having that experience that you want back there being able to handle the pitchers and handling the situations and I think with time she'll be fine and I think Izzy's done a good job there too so you know I, I feel good about both of those kids. You've had expectations all year again uh, another year of this year ranked number third going in mm -hmm. you've comfortable with that you like that yeah you know I I mean if you look at this team right now the one of the strengths is our, our experience and um, so I kind of felt like um, people would look at that at the beginning of the year and say, well, you know, they, they should be good. Um, but again, you've got to go out and play the games and make, you know, and, and win the right games. So we've got a long ways to go. I don't get too excited about preseason polls. Um, but I, you know, I feel good about where this team is right now. I think we, we've helped ourselves. We've got good experience. Um, I think we've got good power. We've got good speed. Um, I think we're going to be able to play good defense and I think we're going to be able to pitch. And if all those things, come to fruition when uh, the uniform's put on and the game's on the line, I think it's going to be a fun team to watch. Because they are older, you like the way they'll be able to handle that, the pressure of being near the top? Yeah, I think the uh, the maturity is something you can't teach. you got to kind of go through it. and You know, you look at our infield with uh, Martinez and, and, and Harper and Karanko, you know, I mean, those kids have been there. They're, they're battle-tested. And so, as a coach, you feel pretty good that they're going to make good decisions. The game's not going to get too quick on them. Um, but, um, you know, I, like I said, I, I like what we have right now. I'm just kind of anxious to, to, to get started, although we, we need some practice time still. Was it a hard sell to get Mariah to come here? Or was I mean, she said she had the prior relationship, so was it just yeah. a matter of reopening that door? Yeah, I think it was a more of reopening the door and then having her come here and feel comfortable. You know, um, we're just we're glad she's here, and, and she's, she's – made that transition very seamlessly and that's my biggest concern with transfers is um, you know how they how they fit in um, with the culture and, and um, the rest of the teammates and she had to step up because she had played with a lot of these kids so um, it worked out well for us. How do you think your schedule will help you? It's really difficult obviously. Yeah, well I've, I've always felt like playing a tough schedule is, is kind of the only way to go. Um, it doesn't matter whether you're 25 and one, and then you get in a Pac-12 play and you haven't played anyone. But um, I think this will give us some some tests on the road. Um, going to Alabama, playing them a couple times there. Um, the Mary Nutter, uh, very solid um, field, and um, get a chance to match up with some SEC teams. Um, and um, you know, I, I, playing the U.S. team can't can't hurt you. And and Team Mexico, we're excited about that. So. Yeah, it's a good it's a good schedule. Um, you know, it's um, a schedule that I think will test us early and um, test us often. And, you know, that's what we need.